We've we've definitely got an issue. Hold on, that's crossing. Okay, we don't need to worry about that. Uh, couple are locked. Oh, that's where the coupler is. Ah, it's this thing. Alrighty, hello guys, welcome your faces back to another Stormworks video, it's not Stormworks! Another Trend Sim World video, uh, it's been a long time since I've actually played this game, but uh, today we are going to be using this Union Pacific to, uh, well actually these two Union Pacifics, to pull these cars right here, which I think we attach to, I'm not entirely sure, um, but we got like a 20 minute mission, so um, yeah, let's go ahead and get on with it. Okay, so if you press escape, uh, we've actually got a schedule right here, so we have to climb aboard, we have to sit in the engineer's seat and lead uh, of the lead locomotive. Okay, good, we have to uh, set the engine run, generator field, and we need to put the fuel pump on. Good. Then we need to set the reverser, do the brakes, power, wait for the service, couple to the formation, and start going. So that's what we're gonna try and do. Again, it has been quite a while since I've played this game, so uh, we're gonna we're gonna try our best here. Uh, whether it goes well or not, I'm not so sure. Uh, we're gonna sit in our little seat. There we go. Uh, we need to do these things. Turn that on. Turn that on. And turn that on. Beautiful. Set the throttle. Wait. Do we have to set the throttle? Set the reverser. Yes. Where is the reverser? Uh, I mean, I can see this. It says one yard. But how do I... The reverser's down there. Hold on. Ah, it's because it was removed. That's weird. <laughs> That's very strange. Uh, turn the brakes off. There we go. And what do I do with this? What do I do with this? Passenger? No. Freight. There we go. We are we are pulling freight. Beautiful. All right, we got a new objective. Apply the throttle to get moving. Okay, throttle set to one. And how do I go to the outside view? I don't know. Oh, there we go. Nice. So we're reversing. We're going to attach to these dudes. And then we're good. There we go. We've attached. Beautiful. Not Wait, was I supposed to go backwards? I think so. Okay. Well, um, we've done that. So we'll apply the throttle again because apparently that's what it wants. And uh, I mean, we're not moving, are we? Oh, we are moving. We are definitely moving. Hey, perfect. What is this? Contact signal? What? Do we have to go backwards? Like, do we have to continue backwards? I'm not sure. Ah, there we go, we've done it. So, that's the cars coupled up. Head down to the nearby unloader to deliver the aggregates. Oh yeah, I forgot that's what we're doing. We're delivering aggregate. Amazing. Uh, which way do we have to go? I don't know whether we have to go backwards or forwards. Nope, we have to go forwards. Alright, let's go ahead and apply some brakes. There we go. Alright, a little bit of brakes. Let's go ahead and set the reverse to forwards. And then we'll start moving forwards. Beautiful. Yeah. Is that going to work? Uh, hopefully that works. Oh, we're speeding. We are totally speeding. All right, set it to, to idle. I think if we set it to idle, it continues going like the similar speed, or if not like the same speed. I, I don't really know about that. Um, that is something that I'm going to continue to say quite a lot during this journey. Uh, I don't really know what I'm doing. So, um... Yeah, there you go. Yo, we can totally walk around. What do we want to see? What's inside the fuse box? Oh, fuses. <laughs> All right, can we just pull fuses out? Is that something we can do? What is this? Radio turbo on. Wait, what? What is this? Hold on. This one's flicked down. Utilities. Are oh, they're already on. Warning devices. Let's go ahead and turn the warning devices on. Yeah, that sounds like a good idea. Uh, what else we got? What else we got in here? Headlights, lights. Everything is, everything seemingly on. What is this? Generator? Oh, everything's on. What happens if we just pull them in, like, one of these big fuses out? What does that do? I don't know. <laughs> but that would be amazing. Fuel, wait, fuse test. Every Everything's fine. Everything's okay, I think. Alright, close the cupboard. We don't want to deal with those right now. Let's get back in our little seat. We are still going, like, the same speed. But we, we have to stop not very far away. So, if we have a little look at our map... We are going down to... We're only going down to here. I don't think we have to change any any tracks either. Wait, we've got beeping. Beeping's happening. What is it? Why is it beeping? Hold on. Alerter. Maybe it's that. No? Why is it beeping? PCS. Open. I don't know what that means. I don't know what that means. I've never had this issue before. <laughs> Somebody help me. 
<laughs> uh, is it to do with that fuse that I did? Hold on. What did I do in here? I flicked a switch. Uh, utilities. No, it wasn't that. Warning. There we go. It was the warning devices. I switched those on. My bad. Uh, I think, I think we're okay now. I feel like we might be, be able to move again. Are we able to? It doesn't feel like I'm set to drive. Hold on. No, we are. No, I don't know what's happening. Hold on. Reverser. Forwards. Throttle to one. Okay, we should start moving forwards. I think it's happening. It is happening. Good. All right. I don't know why that happened. Anyone know what that means? PCS open. I, I don't know what that means. Anyway, let's go to throttle three again and get us up to speed. And we're only stopping down the road. I can't. I, why is this taking so long? And there we go. We're going about 10 mile an hour, which is the speed limit here, apparently. Uh, and we're just going to keep going. Yeah. Wait, we can open the windows. Look. Hey, we can open the windows. How do I turn on the... W we can do put that down too. Yeah. How do I turn on these? Oh, there we go. Look at that. That's much better. That is much, much better. Can I do it on the other one too? Can I turn this one on? I think so. Yes. Beautiful. What is this big box for? Hmm. What is in here? <laughs> I don't know why I'm so interested in all these random things, but I am. You know, it's it's quite cool to be able to walk around inside vehicles. As opposed to, like, the previous train simulator. This one's, this one's really cool. Anyway, sit down on our little seat, if I can. There we go. Let's go ahead and close the windows, in case it gets cold. And uh, we'll keep going. Okay, well, um, this is, this is fine. Uh, I think we have to, yeah, we have to stop here. Um, I, I do want to say something real quick. This isn't the prettiest place in the game. Like, this just isn't. Um, I want to slow down. Dynamic brake, is that what I use? Which brake should we be using normally? I, I have no idea. Let's slam that on. Uh, we've gone too far. Let's slam on this one. And this one? <laughs> Slamming on all the brakes doesn't appear to do anything. Um, oh, actually it does. We have stopped. Alright, turn that one off. Uncouple the vehicles. Alright, we'll do that. I don't know which, which brake we use. Wait, what is this? Control operation. Whoa, what is this? Dynamic brake off? Whoa, you can read a bunch of things. Alright, well, we don't want to do that. Uh, we want to uncouple the things. I don't know which things, but we want to uncouple some of the things. So we'll go backwards, and we'll uncouple... Oh, we're only uncoupling, like, two of them. No, three of them. Okay, <laughs> that's fine. We'll just leave these ones here. Uncouple, please. How do I uncouple it? I don't know how to uncouple it. Do I, go, do I have to go up here? This doesn't seem to make any sense. Why would I go up there to uncouple something? That makes no sense. I think I just have to unplug this. Right? What do I have to do? Is it because we're moving? We are definitely moving. We are definitely moving. Also, I can hear the bell. I don't know why the bell's going off. Surely that's just for like crossings and things. So we're gonna, we're gonna, we're gonna turn the bell off. That is not the bell. That's not, that's the bell. I don't know why that was going off. Uh, right, brake. We're gonna go ahead and apply the automatic brake to full service. There we go. Uh, and I think we've stopped so we can run back there again. All right, let's try this one more time. We've got the option to climb over. That's not what we want. We want to uncouple. Oh, well, I'm climbing over anyway. All right, can I uncouple it from this side? Climb over, climb over. How do I uncouple this? I don't know, how? <laughs> this doesn't make any sense. It does say uncouple first three hoppers. Now, surely that means these ones, but uh, I can't uncouple this one either. Interesting. Oh, right, okay, hold on. Maybe we have to uh, run to the back of this one, okay, because there's a handbrake. If we apply the handbrake, maybe? If we apply the handbrake to this one, then maybe we can go and release it from the front one. Maybe. I, I don't know why we would, no. Maybe that's not how it works. I don't know how to uncouple this. I have legit, no, wait, hold on, what's that? What's that? Do we have to do it underneath? I can't really crouch or anything, but, um, we can't uncouple it. It's not working. Okay, right, I'm trying something new. I'm gonna reverse. We, we're gonna reverse just a little bit. There we go. And maybe that'll then allow us to, uh, to drop it. So that's what we're gonna try and do. We're gonna apply our brakes a bit to, like, full service or, or whatever. Wait, this is the dynamic brake. No, this one. Here we go to full service, please. Thank you. 
And we're gonna get out again. Why is this happening to me? It's booked. It's got, it's got to be booked. I can't do anything here. I can only climb over it. So instead of actually doing the mission, we're just going to go ahead and floor it. And uh, we'll see what happens. Because, yeah, I don't understand why it wouldn't be working. Can I uncouple these two, maybe? Is that something I can do? Hold on, let me drop down. We'll see if we can uncouple these dudes. No, no, no uncoupling going on here. It's impossible. Uh, yeah, so apparently a few people have had a problem with uncoupling. And it doesn't make too much sense. But, um, yeah, we can't uncouple things. I don't, I don't, wait, wait, wait. Couple it locked. Hey, right, we can uncouple this. But we can't uncouple the, the cars. Wait, we need to attach these, though. Uh, I actually want it to be coupled. <laughs> Whoops. All right, okay, hold on. Let me go back to the other bit, and we'll see if we can do it pretty much the same way. If we can't, then I don't know. I I think I pointed at this, pretty much. But climb over, climb over, climb over, climb over. I'm pointing at this thing, and I can't do it. It's broke. All right, whatever. Let's get in the front locomotive and just bail. We'll just go. All right, let's go ahead and turn off that brake. There we go. Set it to forwards, and off we go. Set the throttle to two. I'm pretty sure that's fine. Go ahead and close the door. It's getting a bit noisy, and off we go. Yeah, we've detached. Okay, this doesn't make any sense. This makes no sense. Anyway, uh, we are we are just totally out of here. We're just we're just moving away. That seems like a good idea. Um, I don't know where we're going. There's like a train yard in front of me and that's it. Oh, we need to stop. We need to stop right now. Full service. Turn this off. Put it in reverse. Turn it back on again. <laughs> Whoa, what do we do? All right, okay. Turn this off again. Good. We're just gonna floor it backwards. It seems like a good idea. Or a bad one. I don't know. Here we go. Let's see what happens here. New, 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 boom! It just attaches. Wait, do they attach together automatically as well? They do. Okay. Maybe giving it a good old shunt will have fixed the mission. Maybe. Finally, we did it! So you have to be in like a set place to be able to do- What is this? What? Oh! Wow, okay. Um, so, yeah, I don't really understand why that took so long, but we've done it. So now we just need to go forwards and do the thing. Yes, okay, right. Finally, we get to do something. So it turns out ramming um, ramming the first locomotive into the second locomotive um, fixes all the problems that you would ever have. Uh, I can't remember what we're doing here. So go via location, construction yard. So presumably we just have to move. Wait, is it going to detach? It has detached. Awesome. Okay, right. That's fine. So we're leaving some there and we're going to continue forwards. I don't know whether we're dropping stuff off there. Unload aggregate. I guess we are. I guess we are. All right, cool. Get back inside and go faster. Oh, this makes sense, actually. So uh, the reason we're only taking three in is because we can only drop off three. I, I think that's what that means. Then I think we have to go down that other line right there and then push the other three over it, maybe? I, I feel like that's probably what we have to do, uh, but I don't know. Anyway, uh, I'm going to get back inside and I'm going to go slower if I can. Go ahead and do some, some slowing down. Just a little bit of slowing down. There we go. Uh, and what do we do now? I've got no instruction. Is it... What, what do I do? <laughs> what do I do? Hold on. Unload aggregate. Is it just going to do it itself? Or, or what? How do I unload this stuff? Is it just going to do it itself? Hold on. We are still moving, so that's good. Let's see if it opens and drops. Hey, it does. It does. Look. Hey. Is that all of it gone? That was quick. That was very quick. All right, next. Come on. Open. And drop. There we go. How quick is it going? Dude, look at how quickly that falls out of there. <laughs> all right, next. Come on. Come on, this one. And then we have to get back in our locomotive and drive backwards. We might have to flick this switch, though. I'm not sure. All right, here we go. Come on. Drop your load. Is it doing it? These flaps fly open. And this one isn't opening. Oh, there we go. All right, finally. Good. Yeah. And we pretty much stopped as well. Wait, is that because I've rammed something? Nope. All right. Good. We did it. Now what do we do? What is our next mission? Stop at location South San Francisco East Yard. Ah, okay. Okay, so it didn't really tell me what I needed to do, but I think we need to go flick that switch just so we go, like, 
round the back. Because I feel like the way we're going to actually uh, empty those other cars is we're going to push them. I think. I, I don't really know. Uh, right, okay. Junction left. No, we want to go junction right. Yes. And then we need to reverse all the way down. All right. I quickly set it to reverse. We're going to go ahead and throttle up. We don't actually have any brakes on. Uh, we don't have any brakes on. Okay, so we should just start going backwards. Beautiful. Wait, do we have a horn? We do have a horn. Where is it? There it is. Horn. Whoop, 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 whoop. Nice. Um, right, what are we doing? Uh, I think we have to stop. We do. We have to stop. Ah, uh, how do I stop? How do I stop? Oh! Oh, I see! Oh, this makes sense. Alright, we're gonna decouple these ones. Or uncouple, sorry. Decouple? Is decoupling a word? I think it is. Um, and then we're gonna just grab the other ones, and then we reverse and we put them all together, and that's the end of the mission. Alright, that makes sense. Can we uncouple this? Is this something we can do? Is this something we can do? Uh, uh, hold on, I got a thing. No, that's a crossing. Okay. I don't get anything here. Okay, hold on. Can I do it from up here, maybe? Ooh. Let's open this up and crouch. Can I uncouple this? Nope. How do I uncouple things? Crossing is open. That's fine. Maybe if we can fit down here. Ooh. Oh, I'm pretty stuck. <laughs> I'm very stuck. Okay, we can't go on that side. Dude, decoupling things sucks. It's just not possible. I can't, I can't get to it. I can't actually get in there this time. I don't understand. I don't get it. I can't uncouple things. All right, whatever. We're going to move forward slightly so that we can, uh, so that we can actually get to both sides of it. And then if we can get to both sides, we might have a chance. Maybe. I mean, at the minute, we are currently not moving. Let me, let me throttle up a little bit more. There we go. Good, put it back to one, maybe. Yep, there we go. And that'll keep us moving. Uh, and then as soon as we're slightly in front of these cars, we might be able to get to both sides. All right, we done it. We did it. All right, cool. So now if we get out and we run to the back, we should be able to uncouple it maybe from this side, which if we can, that would be great. If we can't, uh, hmm, <laughs> we've, we've definitely got an issue. Hold on, that's crossing. Okay, we don't need to worry about that. Uh, coupler locked. Oh, that's where the coupler is. Ah, it's this thing. It's this thing. Ah, I didn't know that. I didn't know that. Okay, so we just spent like a million bits of this video doing the wrong thing. <laughs> uh, couple two hoppers. Yeah, we have to go on this side now. All right. Okay. Dude, I feel dumb, but that's, that's fine. Why would I know that? Why would I know that? Why is the bell? Why is why is the bell on again? Why why does the bell keep coming on? Is that normal? That's definitely not normal. All right, we're gonna go to one. That's good. Um, what is that doing? What is that doing? Ah! Oh, I'm just switching seats. All right, that's fine. Um, right, okay. So we're gonna have to go back over the thingy, my Bobby. Then we're gonna have to switch the track again, and then go forwards, and then finally we just reverse, and everything is gonna be fine. I think maybe. We did it! We did it! Alright, we have passed the sign, now we just do this again, there we go, open sesame, and then we go backwards, we attach to those, and we empty them, because that is our job, apparently. We're in reverse again, alright, cool, go ahead and put the throttle up, go ahead and turn the brake off, and off we go. We probably want to be going a little bit slower than this, I think we attach to cars at like 5 mile an hour or something, uh, just so we don't break things. Although I reversed into, like, everything earlier at a million miles an hour, and we were fine. So, maybe it doesn't matter too much. Alright, here it goes. It's happening. It is definitely happening. I'm not inside the, the train right now, so I can't stop it or slow it down. Um, and we're going about five, so, uh, here we go. That's apparently fine. Alright, good. Now we just get back inside, and we go forwards. Alright, set that to forwards. Go ahead and go forwards, and that's literally all we need to do. You know, I don't actually know how fast we need to be going when we go over this, because I don't remember being told, but I, I, it drops really quickly, so I'm assuming we can go quite fast. However, 
Of course, we do need to uh, stop before the end, which, if we have a quick little look at the end, it is just this. So, um, yeah. <laughs> um, if we end up hitting that, then that sucks a little bit. I don't think we actually needed two locomotives for this either. I'm pretty sure we could have done it with one. But, um, never mind. Never mind. Alright, it's happening. It is happening. Alright, drop it. Drop it, drop it, drop it. I feel like we might be doing going a bit too fast. Yeah, we've still got stuff inside. Uh, get inside. Go slower. Turn this off. Go slower. There we go. Alright, we are indeed going slower. And we are emptying our last one. Okay, but there's still stuff in the other two, I'm pretty sure. So if we slam it into reverse, there we go. And we go backwards very slowly. We'll empty them anyway, right? I think so. All right, we're reversing. Here we go. So hopefully all of that will get emptied. Good. And th th there's nothing or not very much in here. So uh, we should be fine. Oh, no. No, we're doing it wrong. I mean, we are doing it right, but we're doing it wrong at the same time. We need to turn. We need to turn. Unless it's going to do it automatically, which I don't think it is. No, we're going the wrong way. We are. We're going the wrong way. What actually happens if we hit these things? I have no idea. Um, I guess we'll just stop, but I, I don't really want to hit them. That's fine. Uh, we need to switch this signal over again, attach them all together, and then I think that's the end of the mission. Signal has indeed been switched. We're going to run back to the front. You know, I don't really understand why we've got the option to, like, climb these things. I, I don't know why you would do that. Like, wait, I'm on the wrong one. I'm on the wrong one. You know, because this is the end of the mission anyway, how about we go for something spectacular? All right, we don't really want to start with eight, but um, let's start with three. And we'll go as fast as we can backwards. And we'll try and smack straight into the trailers. Oh, the cars, sorry. Not allowed to call them trailers. Uh, let's just go for it. Here we go. We're going to go speed eight. Oh, throttle eight. And we're going the right way. So this might end up just being okay. But it also at the same time, maybe not. I don't know. All right, here we go. The train's actually going pretty quick. All right, here we go. Here we go, indeedy. What's going to happen? Smack. Whoa. Well, we actually derailed. We actually managed to derail, but it, it just ends. Why does it just end? That doesn't make sense. It doesn't make any sense. Well, anyway, uh, I'm going to go ahead and end this video here. Um, I have learned how to... to I learned there. I've learned how to decouple things now, so in the next few videos, if we come back to it, uh, we'll know how to do it, so um, that'll be good. Anyway, uh, thank you guys for watching, hope you guys enjoyed it, see you in the next one, goodbye!